going to refute the Catholic heresy of baptismal regeneration. The Catholic Church teaches you have to get baptized to be saved and that baptism washes away your sins. Let me show you what the Catholic Church Catechism says. Uh, this is paragraph 1213. It says, Holy baptism is the basis of the whole Christian life, the gateway to life in the Spirit, and the door uh, which gives us a, or access to the other sacraments. Through baptism we are freed from sin and reborn as sons of God. So baptism is, is what washes away your sins and be, makes you become a son of God, not the blood of Jesus Christ. Um, let me share what the Bible says. Because Roman Catholicism is basically a pagan Roman religion that just uh, became Christianized. Because when Satan started the Roman Catholic Church, he simply just mixed in the pagan Roman religion in with you know Christianity and created this this uh, corruption that is a mix of biblical practices or some practices that they kind of take from the Bible, but then they pervert it with the pagan practices. You know, they prefer communion, they prevert the uh, sacrifice of Jesus Christ. You know, First John chapter one verse seven. What does the Bible say about how your sins get washed away? First John one seven. But if we walk in the light as He is in the light, we have fellowship one with another, and the blood of Jesus Christ, His Son, cleanseth us from all sin. You mean it's the blood of Jesus Christ that cleanses you from all your sins, not the uh, water baptism? Hmm, interesting. The uh, blood of Jesus Christ is what washes away your sins, not baptism. Baptism comes after your salvation. Very, very clear in Scripture. You don't get baptized before you're saved. In Acts chapter 8, the, uh, I think, was it the eunuch? Yeah, the eunuch. He couldn't get baptized before he believed, which kind of destroys the whole thing of infant baptism. Because you have to believe, you have to get saved before you can get baptized. There is no such thing as baptism before your salvation. It's not valid baptism. Not to mention the fact that the Roman Catholic Church doesn't even perform biblical baptism. They baptize by sprinkling, not by emerging in the water. So, it's not even scriptural baptism, but baptism doesn't wash away your sins. The blood of Jesus Christ washes away your sins. So, another example of how the Roman Catholic, you know, uh, Catholic uh, harlot church, I'll put it that way, the uh, Roman Catholic harlot of Babylon, how it contradicts the Word of God. Roman Catholic tradition overthrowing the Word of God, just like the Pharisees in Matthew chapter 15. So, don't be deceived by Roman Catholicism. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all, be with all the brethren. Goodbye. Thank you.